Welcome to the Space Lab Tools informational video. In this video, we will be looking at the pedestal posts. These 1 inch diameter stainless steel pedestal posts are used in applications where rigidity and stability are most critical. They feature 832 or M4 tapped holes on both ends, relief cuts to ensure proper seating, and a quarter inch diameter through hole to allow a ball driver to be inserted for leverage when mounting instruments. This line of pedestal posts is compatible with Base Lab Tools line of PTA 1 inch diameter stainless steel posts. Base Lab Tools currently offers five imperial sized pedestal posts, which each have a metric equivalent on the Base Lab Tools website. Let's look at how these pedestal posts can be clamped down on an optical table or breadboard. The first method is using a clamping fork that surrounds part of the post and sits on the pedestal base. Let's use the 3 inch pedestal post, an SAB0406 solid aluminum breadboard, and a CLF075 clamping fork in this example. First, place your pedestal post where you need it on the surface. Next, position the clamping fork around the post where the clearance slot on the clamping fork aligns with a threaded hole on the surface. Then, using a quarter 20 cap screw, a washer, and a 3 16th ball driver, tighten the screw which will secure the pedestal post and the clamping fork to the surface. Another method of clamping down the pedestal posts is with the CLC1 compact pedestal post clamps. These smaller stainless steel clamps are used for where the surface area on the breadboard is critical. Let's use the 2 inch pedestal post in this example. First, place your pedestal post where you need it on the surface. Next, position the post clamps around the post and where the clearance slot on the post clamp aligns with the threaded hole on the surface. Then, using a quarter 20 cap screw, a washer, and a 3 16 ball driver, tighten the screw which will secure the pedestal post and the post clamp to the surface. You can repeat this process with a second post clamp if desired. A great use for these pedestal posts is with the PTA910 sliding mount stop for a 1 inch diameter post. This allows another component to be mounted off the side of the pedestal post. Let's use an ALM010 adjustable lens mount and pair with the PTA910 sliding mount stop. First, place the mount stop over the top of the pedestal post and set to your desired height by using a 3 16th ball driver and cap screw. Next, place an 832 cap screw in the mount stop, leaving room for the lens mount to be attached. Align the notch of the lens mount to the cap screw and use a 9 64th ball driver to secure the adjustable lens mount to the sliding mount stop. Once in place, you can secure a lens to the mount. Finally, let's look at how we can install an FOM010 fixed optic mount on the pedestal posts. Insert an 832 set screw with the hex key opening face up in the top of the pedestal post using a 564th hex key. Once secured, place the FOM010 on top and twist the mount until tightened. We can also utilize the through hole in the pedestal post to mount this instrument. Insert a 3 16th ball driver through the hole and gently push the ball driver counterclockwise while twisting the FOM010 clockwise to tighten. Thanks for watching the Space Lab Tools informational video. If you enjoyed this video and want to see more informational videos like this, consider subscribing. For more information about these pedestal posts and other Base Lab Tool products, visit www.baselabtools.com. Link is in the description below.